My name's Elizabeth Hunter, I'm an artist. Uh, I'm originally from Edinburgh, Scotland, uh, Aldrike, um, and I now live on the Space Coast in uh, Melbourne, Florida. People often ask me what inspires me artistically, and to be honest, it can be anything. You know, it could be a colour I see, uh, it could be a feeling I have when I look at something, uh, it could be a little bird that I see sitting on a hedge or something. <laughs> Uh, the ocean, of course, the noise of the waves, you know, sunsets. Uh, so, you know, there, there's just so many things that I feel as daily life goes on, you know, um, that will inspire me. And then the second I come into my studio, I, I uh, put it into effect. <laughs> My technique is, is uh, quite unique. I, I've developed it over, you know, uh, a number of years. I work on wood or canvas. Um, so I start with a painting uh, as the first layer, and then I use uh, resin and different pigments um, to build uh, the image. Um, and I'll preserve uh, certain things with uh, transparency into the next layer. I'll mix colors from the previous layer into the next layer. So um, my work um, tends to have a lot of depth to it. Uh, um, and I definitely work in the moment when I'm doing it. You know, once I start uh, painting, um, I'm totally in the moment. You know, I'm not thinking about, you know, why I'm doing it or uh, there's no judgment. I, I'm just in the moment doing it and all kinds of things show up that I don't even put in my paintings. You know, things, things will just show up because maybe I saw something the day before or I was thinking about something or feeling something and it'll just show up in the painting. It's the most peculiar thing. I'd be really happy if I could trigger a positive memory for anyone experiencing my artwork. Maybe a memory of a, uh, somewhere they've been or you know the colors might trigger some emotion or feeling for them you know I tend to work in a really large scale I love to work on a uh, big canvases you know uh, um, and the reason for that is uh, there's a lot of movement in my work so I need to have that freedom to create that flow and that movement within the work uh, and a large canvas is, is how I do that. <laughs> So my artwork is very reflective because I use, uh, you know, uh, resin and uh, different pigments that are reflective. So one of the things I like to do is include the viewer in the painting, so they're actually seeing a reflection of themselves within the painting. Uh, so it's not only an experience to, to create a memory or trigger a memory, is that um, my hope is that everyone feels a part of the artwork when they're looking at it. My client's side, you know, can be anything from, a, a, you know, a modest home, residential home, to a luxury home, or, you know, a full-blown commercial project, a hotel, you know, a commercial building. I just recently finished a 10-story building uh, in Melbourne, Florida, and uh, those projects are a lot of fun. So I often work with interior designers and oftentimes uh, I'm involved in creating custom work uh, for those projects. If anyone wants to learn more about uh, my artwork, uh, please feel free to visit me at elizabethhunterstudios.com. I'd love to hear from you if you want to collaborate on some ideas or visit my studio, I'd be happy to hear from you.